Miguel Asante. Please be seated. By the way, to Ascofu, Baba Paroko, and other Reverend Fathers, speak our way to our National Assembly, Papa Waroma, Waziri Wetu, Waafia Mtoto Hapa, Mimbani, Susan Nakumisha, Governor Wetu, Bwana George Natebea, Senator Wetu, Bwana Alan Chesang, Mjumbe Wetu, Rafiki Yangu, Sana, Fabad Wanyoni, Alias, Makufuli, Biongozi wote wambaya waliofika hapa na wa kristo wenzangu. God is good. And all the time. Tumusifu Yesu kristo. Milele na daima. Munisalimie kwa hewa wana Yesu wa sifiwe. Wana Yesu wa sifiwe tena. Watu ya tanzoia, watu ya kwaza hamjambu. Hamjambu tena. Happy New Year Nimefurai sana kufika hapa kwanza katika county yetu ya maana sana Transoia Nikiwa nimetumwa na kiongozi wa inchi hii yetu Rais wa Jamhuri ya Kenya Dr. William Samuel Ruto na salamu nyingi sana Rais alikuwa mialikuwa na mjumbe wenu kufika hapa alikuwa mekubali Lakini ya kapata safari ya kusafiri mpaka ya inchi ya Japan ambako amekuwa zaidi ya siku tano akitafuta usaidizi wa kiuchumi na akipanga maendeleo ya Kenya baina ya inchi ya Japan na Kenya na kwa hivyo rais amenituma hapa ni mwakilishe amenituma na salamu nyingi na mchango wake mmekubali salamu za rais mmepokea salamu ya rais wetu na kwa hivyo mimi ni seme ni kwa hapa kwa niyama ya rais Kwa sababu mjumbe ya limualika rais hapa wa mialika mimi Lakini ya lijua rais hakija tutakuja na epa moja Na mimi najua ni mtu ya mkono ya rais William Ruto Hame niambia wewe enda unuakilishi hapo diyo nimefika hapa Juwe hayo nimefurai sana kufika hapa Na baba askofu tumeshukuru wewe Kwa mahubiri ambaye imetujenga sana roho zetu Baba askofu umesema wanasiasa na viongozi waongee ukweli. Sasa wewe uko na bahati leo kwa sababu umekutana na mwenye kusema ukweli katika Jamhuri ya Kenya. Si mnajua mimi mtu anasema ukweli? Mimi nasemanga ukweli kwa sababu ukweli ndio wa kudumu. Na kusema ukweli ni kitu ya maana. Na sisi tumefika hapa kujenga We serve the same people. Kama serikali tunatafuta huduma, all the services, na yo kanisa inatusaidia kuchenga roho za watu wetu, kukasa hao break za roho, na kuwapatia imani. Na kwa hivyo, tukipata nafasi ya kuchenga kanisa, tunafurahia sana. Rais William Bruto na mimi ni watu ya kanisa miaka yote. Na tumefanya kazi mingi sana ya kanisa la buwana. Hata wakati ya siyasa baya, baba askofu, siku makanisa ya likuwa ya metishwa na hile viongozi ya mbae waliondoka. Hatu watu zuie kuja kanisani. Hatu kuhufa roho, tulieda kwa zile kanisa na tukaribishwa. Hata kwa Catholic, mabisho kwa likuwa meuzuwa uoga. Hatu wakatupiza marufuku, hatu kuja kanisani, hatu tusitoe saidi ya luhu wa musini. Sasa, Iyo sheria ikiwekwa na hui mwishimua nasema hii kanisa ni amiru ni shirini Hii kanisa ingejegeka Kwa hivi Kwa hivi tumefika hapa Tuendele na kasi ya kujia kanisa la buwana Kwa sababu ni kasi muhimu MC ya mesema Ya kwamba Raisa alipokuwa hapa Aliomba mambo ya maji sindio Mambo ya last mile ya kusambaza maji ifike kwa kila boma Na MC Hills Jari Iyo reporti na fikishia rais akirudi Na rais vile adiahidi atakunya kufanya 
hii kaunti yetu ya Transoia vile governor amesema it's cosmopolitan tuko na kila jamii katika hii kaunti na mimi nashukuru wakaaji wote wa Transoia na viongozi wakiongozwa na governor kwa kuweka amani kati ya jamii na mimi ningetaka kuomba muendelee kukaa vile mheshimiwa Weluke amesema na mkisikia Weluke akisema kitu musikize vizuri huyu ni jamaa ya nguvu huyu meja amefungwa mwaka sabini na ile na agali anatembea si mtu ya nguvu wengine mkifungwa siku mbili karibu mnakufa hata jela nimesikia mtaki mnasema jela ama imevua mingi kwa hivyo mnaoomba kufungwa huyu amefungwa 74 years na ajali is strong so ame advice and i agree with that advice muone kila mtu aone hapa na muzaane tumalize ukabira na tumtuzae watu wengi wa jamii hii dunia Mungu atatupata ile kitu tutakula na vile tutasomesha watoto kwa hivyo i agree let us stay together as a people of Tanzania let us intermarry let us mingle let us love one another let us be a cohesive Tanzania na mimi ningetaka niseme ya kwamba mambo ya usalama i am very happy ya kwamba vile governor amesema vile mjumbe amesema vile weta amesema mambo ya wizi ya ngombe kati ya mpaka hapa na West Pokot imekwamishwa ime na iendelee kukaa namna hiyo and i want to say the county commissioner bwana Oyagi and your security and intelligence team the president and i are very happy with the work you are doing in Transoia ya kuchunga mambo ya usalama na tuendelee kukaa namna hiyo mtu akitaka ngombe atafute ngombe yake awachane na mwingine kila mtu akuwe na ngombe yake kama wewe unapenda ngombe sana tafuta yako uzalishe ulishe ukue na zile ngombe ambazo unataka usipagie mambo ya ngombe ya jirani so our security team and the county commissioner you are doing a good job please continue huyo mjumbe Fabian Wanyonyi ameniomba ya kwamba tuko na upungufu ya magari ya polisi katika hapa kwanza ambayo inatatiza shughuli za usalama na hiyo jambo nitashughulikia so that we can also assist you mimi najua labda vijana wakisia gari zinaongezwa wataki. Mnataka ziongezwe au zipunguzwe? <laughs> sasa sasa mheshimiwa ataongea na watu yako, muamue kama mnataka magari ama mtaki. Sisi najua ni serikali ya demokrasia. Sasa hiyo ni ombi la mheshimiwa utaongea na watu yako. Lakini lazima kazi ya usalama ifanyike. Na kama vijana hamuna mambo ya uhalifu msikue na wasiwasi. Kama muko kwa shamba mnalima hata magari ikiongezwa haitahusika na nyinyi. Magari itahusika na wale ambaye ni watu wanafanya nini? Wanavuja nini? Sheria. So wale ambaye watakuwa shambani wakilima, wakijenga affordable housing, polisi tumewaambia wabadilike. Wakipata wewe kwa barabara umekunywa moja mbili kutafuta usingizi kuliko kugushika kukupeleka polisi wa kupeleka nyumbani kwa bibi yako ukalale. <laughs> si dumbaliana. Kwa hivyo hii magari ikija ni ya kupeleka nyinyi nyumbani. <laughs> so usijali. <laughs> Isipokuwa ni wale ambao wamepita laini sana au watapelekwa pahali ya kupumzika. Lakini wale makosa kidogo kidogo ya kuja moja mbili mimi mambo kidogo kidogo hao wanasindikizwa kwa bibi yao wapate kwenda nyumbani bila shida. Aa uh, hii Tanzania county ni ya maana katika food security of our nation. This is a great county. It is so important in matter of food security. Na ndio rais alipochukua ushukani. Tulikuta tukiingia bolea ilikuwa shilingi 1700. Rais amengangana as we speak today. Bolea is 2500. Na imejazwa hapa katika Tanzania and governor nataka nikushukuru kwa kufanya last mile kusambasa bolea ikaribie wakulima na mimi nataka kuomba nyinyi mtie bidii lakini watu ya Tanzania pia mkilima mahindi vile mmelima vizuri msiuze kila kitu mbakisha ingine ya kukula si ndio sasa nyinyi ndio wenye kuzalisha mahindi hapa mnauza yote alafu muombe a 
atakusaidiwe na msaada wa maidi hatuwezi hatuwezi kubali hatuwezi unajua mimi pia kusema ukweli baba askofu zimesema niseme ukweli we cannot give you the food transoya because you are the highest producers of meat in this country you cannot sell everything mubaki bila chakula mseme tulete msaada msaada tutapeleka pahali hakuna watu wanalima chochote but for transoya ukilima gunia mia moja weka gunia 20 ya familia gunia 80 sukuma kwa soko ndio tuweze kuendelea mimi nataka niseme kwa mambo ya wakulima wa maziwa as a government tumepanga kulikuwa maziwa yamekuwa mingi kwa sababu ya mvua nyingi tukatoa 900 million ya ku stabilize the prices na pale KCC ikakuwa ni 45 shillings per liter and kuanzia the first of march mwaka huu itakuwa ni shilingi hamsini kwa kila lita ya maziwa na kwenda mbele tutajaribu kusukuma mpaka 60 so take advantage take your milk to the new KCC at a good price ambaye imewekwa na serikali again mambo ya walimu tumeandika walimu 56000 kujaribu kusaidia kila shule na vile mmesema hapa mambo ya JSS tumeambia walimu na wasikie kwa sababu wengine wasiki sijui kama ni mambo yameweka kwa masikio ama ni iko shida gani mambo ya JSS mwalimu asifukuse mtoto ati mambo ya uniform na mambo ya dawati kama mzazi hana pesa ya uniform asome na ile ya zamani mpaka ile ingine ipatikane na tumeambia walimu rais amesema na nirudie nikiwa hapa Tanzania wewe mwalimu ukifukuza mtoto wa JSS kabla afike nyumbani wewe utakuwa umetangulia tumekubaliana na kwa hivyo tunataka kuambia walimu wetu let them not send our children home unnecessary over levies and unnecessary fees that they are introducing at the school na tunataka wabunge wale wa national assembly watusaidie to monitor what these teachers are doing and tell us so that we can take appropriate action again is help teachers ambao wanakeuka zile maagizo imewekwa na serikali mambo ya afya nataka niseme nikiwa hapa Tanzania president william ruto and i are very proud of susan na komisha as cs health huyo mtoto wenu ni shupavu and i can confirm from where i sit mimi i chair the cabinet committees on behalf of the president i'm in charge of implementation of cabinet decisions and i want to say nikiwa hapa Tanzania Tanzania mimi na rais tunajivunia huyu msichana mlitupatia atusaidie kazi she is a very very focused and a committed cabinet secretary na tunataka tuseme amepanga wizara ya afya vizuri na she is one of the most committed cabinet secretaries who are focused and who know where they are going and what they are doing so wewe Susan kanyangia hapo lakini ukumbuke ukumbuke hata ukifanyia Kenya kazi charity begins at Yeah. Ujue hata ukija kutufanyia kazi kila pahali kwanza utengeneze nyumbani. Ndio hata sisi tukuamini unaweza kutusaidia. Na ujue hata Yesu alianza Jerusalem kaza, ka, kabla aende Judea. Sisi ndio Jerusalem yake. This is the Jerusalem. So usaidie governor afate madawa lakini governor kama kulikuwa na madeni kwa kemsa lazima ulipe kwa sababu dawa ya deni ni kufanya nini dawa ya deni ni kufanya nini si ndio si si mimi nasema if there are deaths ilichukuliwa na predecessor ukue kama sisi sisi na rais tumekuta madeni ya 9.8 trillion tunalipa hatuwezi ruka hiyo ni madeni ya Kenya si mimi nilisema mbale kasarani siku ya ya, ya, ya inauguration nikasema tumekuta Kenya imeisha kwa kwa store hata panya alitoroka hakuna kitu ya kukula nzima rais amenyang'ana karibu 1 year hata tuko na ingine kubwa inaitwa euro board inakuja mwezi wa 6 ndio tutang'ana vile tutalipa
kwa sababu ukikuta madeni ilichukuliwa na serikali iliyoko mbele yako those are your debt ile mambo mzuri kama na ume inherit assets we inherit ile umepata mabaya liabilities you also inherit hata sisi tumepata madeni ilichukuliwa na rais huru kenyata na ile mzee azimio sasa hatuna namna si lazima tulipe kenya isibikiwe kenge kengele so gavana i sympathize with you but you have to pay lazima ulipe hiyo madeni upate madawa because hakuna namna nyingine hata sisi njia simefurahi sana kulipa madeni hatutaki kenya ikiwe blacklisted and that is why for one year watu wanakuwa impatient hii watu azimio wanatupigia kelele hii madeni ni hao walichukua wakiwa serikali ya handshake na sisi tunalipa madeni yao na hatulalamiki watu badie nafasi zilipo madeni na tuko karibu kumaliza hii madeni alafu sasa ndio kazi itembee na ndio unaona sisi tumelangana tukiingia unga ilikuwa 230 tumelangana imeteremka mpaka 1 jaribu eh hey, hata si mtupigie makofi tumelangana mimi ni sema ndio nikimalizia tuko na mambo ya wamama na wazee wale ya miaka sabini tukiingia tulikuta iko deni ya miezi kumi na sita wote tumewalipa pesa yao tumekarabati maneno tumepanga hata kukiwa na shida siku hizi wamama na wazee wanalipwa on time kabla ya tarehe 30 rais aliamua kabla sisi tulipwe wamama wetu na wazee wetu walipwe wale walikuwa wamefikisha miaka sabini hapo wameandikishwa tumeandikisha hawa ikifika mwezi ya tatu wataanza kupata ile marupurupu yao ya elfu mbili kila mwisho ya mwezi wadunue dawa wadunue chakula wasukume maisha kwa hivyo tunasema ya kwamba tutaendelea na kupanga maneno yetu vile inatakikana nikimalizia niseme kwa umoja ya eneo hili ya magharibi ikiweko Tanzania kinara wetu bwana speaker I want to congratulate you and the leaders from the western region kwa ile effort mnaweka ya kuunganisha watu ya western province hapo mbeleni mna kuanga mna pita jia kando kando wabukusu wakipita huko wa maragoli napita pande hii wa triki napita huko wa idao napita pande hiyo sasa hiyo ndio amuendaki bali kama sasa nyinyi watu wa Tanzania mliona kabisa rais William Ruto anaenda kushinda kula zani mnachukua zingine mnapatia ile msaya ya kusamia sasa ile sababu gani mnafanya watu wa Tanzania what, what calculation do you do lazima mpige darubini sasa niulize nyinyi watu wa Tanzania. Nimuulize swali? Nimuulize? Huyu rais William Ruto alishida ile mzee ya kitendawili akiwa na Uhuru Kenyatta, akiwa na machiefs, akiwa na polisi, akiwa na county commissioners, hata huyu natembea alikuwa pande hiyo akaanguka. Sasa William Ruto ndio rais. Hii mzee kuna baadhi anaweza bidia 27. Sasa nyinyi nobody hakuna mtu yote anataka kwenda upinzani hali ya mawongo sasa mlijaribu wale mlienda pande hiyo haikufaulu na ndio nataka niseme bwana Tabia ulifanya mzuri ulikuja kwa rais ukasema tufanye kazi pamo that is leadership that is being pragmatic because resources yote iko kwa serikali yule mzee hakuna kitu anaweza kwa watu wa Tanzania hata yeye mwenyewe anakuja kwetu kutafuta kitu kukula sasa kama yeye mwenyewe anakuja kwetu nyinyi mkienda kwake hiko kitu mtapata so i want to appeal to the people of Tanzania going forward mujipange nyuma ya hivi viongozi wenu mujipange nyuma ya William Ruto na muunganishe western so that ikuje ungane with the rest of Kenya pale mlima Kenya tumeunganisha hapo western wetaunganisha rift valley wanaunganisha then zote tuungane chini ya president William Ruto deputy speaker unaniambia ati nimwambie natembea akae karibu na mimi mimi hata sitahili kumwambia for natembea is a natural step because natembea is government from the time he was employed to today huyu tulikuwa na yeye na hii uniform moja mimi nilikuwa mkubwa kwake tulikuwa madio pamoja alafu akakuwa DC hii mtu hata ukikata damu yake ni serikali si ndio 
Ndiyo alikuwa anaangalisha huyu neno. Because alikuwa mtu ya serikali, one of the most efficient administrators ambaye tumekuwa nayo katika Kenya hii. The blood of George Natebea is government. Sasa wewe bwana George Natebea wewe ni serikali tangu zamani. You have no business in opposition. Hiyo watu hata mwezi elewana kwa sababu wewe si mtu ya maandamano, wewe si mtu ya kuweka sufuria kichwa, wewe si mtu ya kelele, wewe ni mtu ya serikali tangu zamani. Kweli ama uongo? Unataka akae na serikali? And bwana Natebea come we work together. We have worked with you before. You are government, you understand government like the back of your hand. You know how useful it is to be in government. Please lead the people of Tanzania into government so that they can get a lot of development, they can get services from the government. So George Natebea requires no invitation to government. He is governed by blood. See Dio? Anda akisimama hapa anaongea kama serikali. Huyu alisali na mambo ya upinzani. Awezi, awezi, he is not, he is, his DNA is government. So, yeye yeah, ya kuje, na tumemkaribisha, we'll work together, and don't worry, but na governor. The national government will take responsibility for our decisions. Don't worry. Sisi hile tutamua, we will take responsibility. Wewe kama county hile tutamua, you will take responsibility. The two levels of government are, are independent, of course, they also uh, complement each other. And where we need to bring convergence, we will be able to do so. But I want to say I'm grateful. Kwa hile kazi na indulia pa Transoia, buwana governor, jaribu, weka watu pamoja. This is a cosmopolitan county and it is good when people are working as one. Mimi kabla ni Anze Mchango, pia ni mefaishu wa sana na hii kwaya. Very good kwaya. So, as you know, a church is as good as a square. Kwa hivyo kwa zile project hiyo ni nini? Nitapeana 200,000 kwa hii kwaya. So that uh, you see what you can do. Yeah. Then pia nime nimefurahishwa sana na ile watoto wa PMC. Wale walikuwa hapa na kwa hii through mwalimu wenu nitapeana 100,000 muone what you can do. Kwa hivyo mimi mimi nataka nifanye ile kazi Raisa alinituma hapa ya kuokota pesa, si ndio? Si mimi ni mtu ya kutumwa. Si nilipewa kazi ya kibarua. Sasa mimi naweza ongea mambo mingi ni haribu. Waacha nifanye ile kazi nilitumwa unga yangu isikuje kumwa isikuje kumwagika. Na mimi nataka niseme watu wa Tanzania wale ambao mliunga rais wetu mkono. Those who voted for President William Ruto Mimi ya mungu wa muna nijua sana Mukimpigia rais Pia mimi nikapata baati ya po nikapata Nataka nisemi ya santi Thank you very much Wale mulipigia rais muka nifigia pa moja Nikapata kibarua Na muna jua mimi nilikuwa kwa halibaya sana Nilikuwa kwa kona mbaya Si muna jua nilikuwa kwa kona mbaya Eh Kuwa kwa kona mbaya sana Waiko wale mulipigia rais Nikapata ya hapo, nika, ni, nikapatia hapo wa raiza kipata Ya hapa kutemea, muna daka ni kuja tena Ama ni lale leo Iko bahari ya kulala Iko kitu ya kukula Lakini hapa nasikia iko baridi ndalala na mnagani Eh Eh Asante sana thank you very much. Waacha sasa tufanye ile kazi ambayo ilitulete ambayo ni ya kuchangisha